Hi, is this Joey Smith? Yeah, I was looking at your resume for the position you applied for, and I was wondering if you had time to come in for an interview. Uh, how does Monday work for you? Okay. I'll see you Monday at 12 o'clock. Thanks. This is Joey Smith. He is a recent IUPUC graduate. He graduated with a business management degree. He has come back to IUPUC today to interview with Professor Kelly for the new athletic director position. He's really nervous, but little does he know that he's got a big project that Professor Kelly has for him. We know he'll do great. Let's see how he does. Good luck, Joey! Hi, nice to meet you. I was looking over your resume and saw a few things about you that really made me think that you might be qualified for this position. Uh, I'd like to start with just a few questions, if that's all right. Okay. I was wondering, what management is to you? Uh, I think management, uh, a good definition is getting things done with and through other people. Nice, nice. All right, well, uh, why would you say that you are qualified or deserve this position? Um, I think I'm motivated, uh, creative, hardworking. Okay, uh, for this position that we're looking for, that's a lot of the qualifications and measurements that we're looking for, so I, uh, I think you might be what we're looking for. Cool. So thanks for coming in, and I'll give you a call to let you know. It was nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thanks. Hey Joey, how you doing? Pretty good, how are you doing? Pretty good. You excited for your first day? Oh yeah. Alright, go ahead and take a seat. So I've got an idea for your your first project. Okay. Since you're a recent IEPUC graduate and you're still young, unlike myself. I uh, was wondering if you could possibly come up with a mascot and a name for that mascot for the school. Okay. How does that sound to you? Um, tough. Tough? Yeah. Well, you know, you're young and I figured you'd have some ideas that might work. And I want you to gather up a group of people, if you can do that, to work on the project with you. Okay. That would be easy. All right. Get started on it and get back to me. Alright, I'll get right on it. Alright. Hello. Hi. I'm Joey. I'm Annie. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're pretty good at drawing there. Well, thank you. I'm an art professor here at the school. Cool. Uh, I'm forming a group. Uh, to work on a project, and I need somebody that's really creative. How would you like to join the group? Well, what kind of project is it? We have to come up with a mascot for the school. Okay, yeah, I'd love to. I also have two other people that would like to would be good at the job, and Sydney Cox and Jonathan Bales. Great. That's okay with you. Yeah. Okay, when do you want me to start? Uh, as soon as possible. Okay, where? Uh, we're meeting in the conference room. Okay, great. I'll see you then. It was right. nice meeting you. Thank nice you for this you. opportunity. Sure. The five stages of group development are forming, storming, norming, performing, and adjourning. Come in. Hey, why is your door open? Only open minds are allowed in here. Okay, this is the great. idea room. Well, I brought Sydney and Jonathan right. to meet you today. They're the ones that I recommended. This is Sydney Cox. She's in charge of student government, and Jonathan is in charge of the men's basketball team. It's nice to meet you. And I thought their input would be important today. So we brought our ideas to the table. Hope you like them. You already told them about what we're working on. I did. I explained it in very full detail. Awesome. We're working so. on a Developing a mascot for the team. What are your ideas? 
Well, my first idea were the kitties because they're soft and they're innocent and it's different from what everybody else has today. Really? This would be a good time to introduce the trash can. This is where bad ideas go. Well, I was thinking the trash can. The bears. You know, like they... John, you're right. Okay, my second one was a tiger because they are more fierce than kitties, just in case that's what you like. It's better, but no. Leadership is the process of inspiring, influencing, and guiding others to participate in a common effort. There are two types of leadership, formal and informal. Formal leadership is the process of influencing others to pursue official objectives. Maslow's hierarchy of needs says that people always have needs, and when one need is relatively fulfilled, others emerge in a predictable sequence to take its place. Hertzberg's two-factor theory implies that a satisfied employee is motivated from within to work harder and that a dissatisfied employee is not self-motivated. Expectancy theory is based on the assumption that motivational strength is determined by perceived probabilities of success. Goal-setting theory is the process of improving performance with objectives, deadlines, or quality standards. I called this special meeting because I think you guys need some motivation. But I want to talk to you about the goal setting theory. It's the process of improving performance with objectives, deadlines, or quality standards. So just keep this theory in mind throughout the week and hopefully it motivates you. We'll try our best. Thank you. Mm -hmm. well, I'll see you at the next meeting. All right. Thank you. Coffee is not very good. Hey, my coffee is awesome. What are you talking about, John? It's just not any good. I can't drink it. You're, anymore. you're ridiculous. My coffee is awesome. Do you yeah. even use a filter? Yes, I use a filter. Listen. What are you talking about? <laughs> Sydney. Uh -huh. yes. Yes. yes, Joey. I've had your coffee, and I have to say, it's not the best I've ever Thank had. You. Thank you. I'm not. I'm not saying it's terrible. It's just, eh, maybe we should let someone else try to make coffee from now on. I'm fine with that. I hate coffee anyway. Well, great. Okay. Well, now that that's all cleared up, I oh. have good news. I thought of a good team idea, and it is the IUPUC Pride. And as you know, Pride is also known as the Pack Alliance, so our mascot can be a lion. Specifically Very with mean. the name of Simba. I like Grown that. up Simba. I like it. Okay. Well, here you can look at it close up. Mean and fierce. Mm -hmm. This is great. Well, thank you. I worked really hard on it. Well, let's get it out there. Okay. And Sydney and Jonathan helped me with that too. So it Good. wasn't just me. Good work. It was teamwork. Great teamwork. Thank you. This is awesome. Okay. Well. We'll see you next time. Yep, when I get the next project. Have a good day. All right, good job. Thanks for all the hard work. I'm getting ready to take it to Professor Kelly. All right, Bye -bye. sweet. Thank you.
Wow. It's just a sample. Now it's a sample? Yeah, it'll be a lot bigger once we're done. You know what? I love it. I think it's a really good idea. You know, you've really you've really outdone yourself this time, Joey. I mean, this is good quality work and I think it's gonna go over well with the student body. Cool. Thanks. Awesome. Hi, Janice. Uh, could you send Joey down to my office, please? All right, thank you. Hey, hey Joey, good to see you again. I had a couple things to discuss with you about the project that I had you on. Okay. Uh, overall, I'm very satisfied with it, and I was wondering if you knew much about grassroots change. Uh, yeah, it's the informal change. Well, I was doing some reading through some old textbooks of mine, and I came across a, a checklist for grassroots change, and it really surprised me how well that you fulfilled it. You were pretty good with preparation, you uh, planned everything out, and you had a strong purpose throughout. You kept in mind the project that I asked you to do. You demonstrated participation by gathering a group of other employees to help you, and you make progress throughout, and you were able to share that progress with me. And most of all, you were persistent. So that pretty much covers all of the areas of grassroots change, and through that, you're able to turn your idea for the mascot and logo into an action. And I just wanted to thank you for that. Thanks, Professor Kelly. It means a lot that you recognize that. Yeah, you did a really good job, and I'll get back to you with your next project, but I'll be expecting some pretty good work. You set the bar really high this time.